Okay, we've got a, a curve here. Um, we're given the uh, equation of that curve there. Now, what you hopefully will notice is that this here is exactly the same as the equation you've got up there. The only difference being that instead of its y equals, um, the y has been swapped for a minus 5. So if we draw the line y equals minus 5 on there, okay, we should end up with a, our solution to this particular equation. Notice it only cuts at one point, which is about there. Read off, and you should get minus 3.4. Okay, so that's the first one. All right, and there you go. Now, the second one's a little bit harder because you'll notice it's not quite the same. Instead of minus 9x, we've got minus 4x here. Okay, so how do we get that? Um, we'll, well, in order to get from minus 9, I want, basically, this is what I've got. All right, um, oops, there we go. That's really badly done. I must must try harder there. X squared, good. Um, uh, I want this, all right, and I can put something on the other side. Now, in order to get to minus, for, uh, to minus 4, I need to add 5x on this side, don't I? I need to add 5x to get to minus 4, which means that on the other side, it's going to be minus 5x. So I need to draw the line y equals minus 5x. Okay, and y equals minus 5x here. It's going to cross at 0, 0. It's going to cross there, there. So it's gradient of minus 5, isn't it? Right, and there, and there, and there. So I'm going to draw that as neatly as I can. Right, which is not very, but it's... Oh, that's terrible down near the end now. I'll try and draw that a little bit better. There we go. Now then, we've got to find where this cross is. Fortunately, I didn't do it too badly there. And that's that. So that's minus 2.6, I think. I think they've got minus 2.5 um, there. Uh, but yeah, I'd look look very carefully. In fact, yeah, it would be minus two point five. It's because I haven't used a ruler because I can't use a ruler essentially um, on this. So there you go. Oops. All right. So we should have a crossing place there. All right. A little bit harder here. I'd use what you have. All right. What they're wanting you to do is to use what you have. All right. Um, by rearranging. That's where I've got this from here. Okay, so I'd get minus five. I need to plus five x to get to uh, minus the minus four x in the question there, right? So on the other side, when I when I balance it, it's going to be minus five x. All right, not not the easiest, but actually once you see it, it's not too hard.